Employees out of the VA Medical Center in Plains Township took to the picket lines today. They say they're looking for fair treatment and better job rights. 2822 News was at the rally and our reporter Emily Allegrucci joins us live in the studio to share what they had to say today. Emily. Good evening, Nick. Those who rallied outside of Wilkes-Barre Veteran Affairs Medical Center for several hours today rallied with purpose. They are hoping to send a message to representatives in Washington, D.C. about funding, hoping for better pay and to fill their many job openings. That we are together and tight. We will remain tight and solid for fairness. That's all you're asking for. It was called an informational rally, but there was a strong message members of the American Federation of Government Employees, Local 1699, wanted to get out. AFGE, -E. what does that stand for? Quality care. AFGE represents Wilkes-Barre Veterans Affairs Medical Center, where they argue management is underpaying workers and underproviding for veterans. We wanted to make sure folks are aware that a third of the people that work here are vets, taking care of vets, doing that most valuable work for the people that have sacrificed so much. Those employees deserve the resources to take care of that solemn oath with their brothers and sisters. Much of the rally Friday revolved around employees' pay or the lack of it. Workers say Wilkes-Barre VAMC management refuses to grant local pay adjustments. We are one of the lowest paid nursing agencies across the country for the VA system. We need to be valued for where we live locally and the work that we do daily. Workers believe the salary disagreements have resulted in a staffing shortage, specifically with nurses. Less nurses on hand means less care for those who need it. We need people to be well rested and make a fair pay doing it so we can retain great nursing and great physicians and providers and treating our veterans daily. When you're down as many positions as they are here, it impacts care and it contradicts the mission of the VA. The people doing the work, the boots on the ground, need the resources to honor our commitment to the vets. And what these ralliers say they're really looking for is the respect of congressional leaders who have the ability to help with their funding. Nick, back to you. Uh, Emily, thanks.